<laughs> Don't worry, everybody, it's just water. Well, this is still water. It's still potato water. <laughs> anyway, Andreas, I love you. <laughs> ben, Ben, did oh my you not God. read the, the rules that Andreas gave us for the speech? I never. What, what rules? Okay, I didn't read them either, but, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so number one, uh, Dan, don't hit on Joy. <laughs> I can't, I can't promise that. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> two, seriously, Dan, it's gonna piss off Shane. <laughs> Alright, 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 fine. I will say, I was the last guy to walk down the aisle with her, though, okay? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Don't say any swears. Well, well shit, Ben, you messed that up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All right, now we have other rules specifically made for Dan. <laughs> Andreas, you're my oldest and closest friend that I've had throughout my entire life. We've known each other for 22 years, and throughout the years, there was no one else that I would call my best friend. We've shared so many experiences together. Being on the sound booth together for the last 10 years, getting everything last second from people, but still get, making it work without batting an eye. Uh, yeah. Taking martial arts together, like we were in the Christmas parade, and I slammed you to the ground so hard oh. that guy screamed out, did he crack his skull? <laughs> the awkwardness of middle school, like, you know, when we were in the hallway together and we fell over each other right in front of my crush at the time? Thank you again for that. <laughs> the drama of high school, but not class we want to take, unfortunately, and the sense of achievement of us graduating, albeit with a year in between, the self-discovery of our early 20s and all the little things in between, the multiple food runs, hangouts, beach days, road trips, church groups, vacations, most recently which being your fashion weekend in Maine. <coughs> Sorry, we, uh, we made a friend up at that time, you know, his name is Tyler, he was a really cool dude, we Walked out of our cabin, we stealing our food, and we no. yelled at us and we called him out. It was a pretty cool dude. Thanks. Uh, <laughs> some porks in a car accident where he got on the side of the road, so if we all just take a moment and silence for our friends. What? Dude, he was a squirrel. But he was <laughs> our squirrel, Dan! <laughs> anyway, Andreas, the only one I've chosen to be with is smart, beautiful, funny, God fearing. He knows how to clap back at Dan. And speaking of Dan, he hasn't been the center of attention for the past few minutes, so take it away. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. So now that Ben's sappy speech is over, uh, Mariah, I, I actually think my speech is more for you uh, than anyone else here. Uh, I, I have titled it. Uh, so you decided to spend the rest of your life with my disastrous roommate. A list oh of God. things to be aware of. So uh, no need to take any notes. I, I, I have them here, but uh, please, please. Pay attention. So, number one, uh, I recommend becoming gun owners, because uh, a lot of people lost a lot of money on Andreas tonight. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Two, <laughs> no need for an alarm clock. Uh, just wait for Andreas to wake up and eat his cereal. The rest of the neighborhood will be joining you. <laughs> Three, it doesn't matter how many times you turn off the lights in the house, Andreas will always find a way to leave them on. Uh, he will quickly rebut saying that it's only $8 per year, uh, but neglect the fact that we have 97 light bulbs in the house. Uh, four, I did my best to teach him how to do laundry. Uh, now if only we could get him to do it more than once a year. Uh, five, when he says he made you some dinner, always be prepared for freezer burn chicken pot pie. Uh, it's never made anything. Six, when he says he'll get to it tomorrow, he means no, you do it. <laughs> Seven, when it comes to cleaning the house, please be sure to give him at least six months notice, otherwise he won't do it. <laughs> Eight, if you ask him to go do something with you later, pay very close attention to those modifying words. He will always try to find a way to weasel out of it later. <laughs> Nine, be prepared to frequently check the, uh, the leftovers in the fridge. I, I believe he still has a pizza in there from 2002. Um, <laughs> Brought it over from my parents' house. <laughs> <laughs> There's preservatives in it. <laughs> Ten. I hope you enjoy random installments in the house because I certainly did not enjoy a 250 foot ethernet cable from my bedroom to the basement. <laughs> that was less than enjoyable. Eleven. Make sure that you compliment his butt at least twice a day. <laughs> he might get weirded out, but he needs the positive encouragement. <laughs> 
Well, if you're ever having a bad day, just call him on your way back from work. He's been trained to know that that is code for have a bowl of ice cream ready for me by the time I get home. That's true. Nevertheless, it is true. It is very true. Nevertheless, despite all of these quirks, uh, get ready to have the best time of your life because uh, Andreas is the best there is. Uh, the Nick and Schmidt era may be over, but I know for a fact that he will enjoy this era much, much more. So anyway, Andreas, I know that sometimes you struggle to verbally express how you feel about somebody. So how about you just whistle it instead? Uh, Dan, uh, you know you can't whistle. Just burp it out. Ben, oh my god, he can't burp either. <laughs> you know that. We all know that Spanish is a love language. Just say it in Spanish, mi amor. Dan, you can't roll his R's either. <laughs> love is goofy, just lick your nose. Ben, sometimes love isn't physical. Andreas, just take her on a trip. Sweden, perhaps? Dan, you know it got cancelled due to the pandemic. You know, Andreas, just celebrate with a drink. Ben, you know he can't hold his liquor. Andreas, just make a successful music video. Oh. 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 Dan, that was a low blow. Andreas, yeah. you know, love is decisive. Just step up and choose the best man. Oh. In conclusion, you two are perfect. I regret both of these. <laughs> But you're stuck with them. <laughs> but seriously, in conclusion, you two are perfect together. The love you have for one another is immense and apparent. We are both so happy for you. If you ever need us, don't hesitate to call. Seriously, yeah. Congratulations, Andreas and Mariah. Um, welcome to the madness, Mariah. <laughs> I do love Andreas like a brother, so I, I am sincerely glad to have gained you as a sister. So it, it's, it's fantastic. So, congratulations, guys.